As we focus on the faces of addiction in our community and the growing epidemic of prescription pain pill and heroin use, there is something that we can all do to try to help. That is get rid of our old unused drugs. Often they lay around your house for years. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester shows us how easy that is. Hank. Yeah, Devin Sandra, it is very easy, but experts say don't just throw them in the trash. They could end up in the wrong hands. Don't flush them down the toilet. It could possibly cause a problem with the water supply. Uh, what you can do, though, is take them to many police agencies, medical centers, also local pharmacies. Here's what you need to know to stay safe. Look in your medicine cabinets, do a search of your home, anywhere you have old and unused medication, get rid of it. So far this year, I've disposed of about 2,500 pounds of prescription drugs. The Oakland County Sheriff's Department says it has had great success with its Operation Medicine Cabinet program. The department has 36 different locations where people can safely drop off their drugs. Studies have shown that an abuse of prescription drugs ultimately many times leads to heroin addiction. And heroin right now is a scourge. It's made a strong comeback. It's very, very cheap on the street. I believe it's really important is that, you know, people become more aware of addiction issues and also how they have some responsibility within their own household. Uh, disposing of opioids and other, you know, dangerous medications is sometimes a real challenge. Lori Wazalowicz is the Director of Pharmacy Services at Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan. She's also on the state's Prescription Drug and Opiate Abuse Commission, created to come up with solutions to this epidemic. She wants people to be educated on the resources available to them. Making sure that they recognize that saving those extra pills just in case is actually one of the leading causes of teenagers and young adults becoming addicted to pain medications. If you don't need them, get rid of them. Bring them into one of the locations and, and get rid of them right away. Don't flush them down the toilet. Don't throw them in the garbage. Bring them here, bring them to your local police department and dispose of them that way. You don't want your children or somebody who may have an addiction problem getting these pills. Uh, we should also tell you most police departments will tell you the best thing to do is throw the lid on top of the pill bottle, put that bottle uh, within a sealable bag, a Ziploc like this, and then you can drop them off at many drop off locations of police departments. No questions asked. Uh, it is good to call ahead though, ask for the information and the drop off locations, but most police departments and medical centers will take those pills and will not ask you any questions. We're live here tonight. Hank Winchester, back to you. Yeah, and the old way, Hank, was to flush things down the toilet. I'm glad you put that's not a great, great answer for the water supply. So if you want to know where you can drop off your unused prescription drugs, we've put a link at clickondetroit.com.